Memo Coles, Harold Miner at the guard. Steve Smith's moved up front with Glenn Rice. So now Miami with a small team on the floor. Oh, man. So Miner quick. doesn't play small. No, he's so quick and so strong. You know, I always felt he was taller. When you look at him, he's got a, a, a strong-looking body on him. I thought he was longer and lankier when I first saw him on television. He's a powerful player. Six to go in the first half. Harold Miner, not bashful. See, look where Stacy Ogden is always playing back in the post because Miner doesn't have three-point range. That shot's a little bit out of his range, but he buries that one. He had to step in for it. It was a two, of course. Keep your eye on Glenn Rice in his possession. I think he's going to try to come off the screen and get a jumper at the top of the circle. Off the screen, didn't get the jumper. Lang stepped out. He'll take it anyway. Good call, Doug. Look at Harold Miner, former slam dunk champion. He explodes. Harold Miner out of Southern Cal. It is a four-point Atlanta lead. 2.53 remaining in the second quarter. The Hawks lead by six. We're going to show you the spectacular play by Harold Miner. He's on the baseline, 32. And when Glenn Rice goes up with his jump shot, no one gets a body on him. And that's how you see these spectacular plays made in the NBA. You've got to put a body on these guys. They're such great leapers. Rice is going to give you the pump fake. Andrew Lang leaves his feet. and. You're going to see Miner come into the picture with a spectacular play. Saw a lot of that at Southern Cal. Hawks forwards with 32 of the Hawks' 51 points. Under two minutes, first half. Wow. Somebody wow. is going to have to stop. The man who's defending Miner is Augman, known as an excellent defender, but he's not doing much of a job on Harold Miner, who has 10 points. Under a minute, Willis. Bad pass right out to Steve Smith to Harold Miner. Look out. And the foul. Harold Miner's really giving this team an, an emotional jump off the bench. Giving them great offense. And that quickness to the bat. See, Willis was pushed out of bounds there just enough to have to cough the ball up. And he goes to Harold Miner. We've seen some sensational plays by him. He's five for seven has 10 points all in the second quarter. So as Miami has cut into this uh, Atlanta lead, it's been on the strength of Harold Miner. So in game one, really not a factor in their win. But tonight, giving them a chance here, maybe steal another game. Harold Miner. Watley misses from very long range. Miami has been held scoreless in five minutes. Adam T played 15 minutes the other night. Former slam dunk champion Harold Miner getting some garbage points here. 101 83. Atlanta has this one. Atlanta finally reached that magical 100 point barrier. They had 88 and 89 in the last two games against Miami. And on the season, when they score 100 plus points, they're 42 and 3. Lang had it stripped from him. Watley fell down trying to catch Harold Miner. He's got a floor burn. I think he's all right, but that sure does sting, you know very well.